As I promised you yesterday, you can go explore the island now. I've opened up the gates for you. Don't worry, I won't let you off without a very important task, that's for sure. This is as important as me teaching you how to walk on two legs, and that's pretty unusual for beavers. Your mother runs a coffee shop in the town nearby. I need a mixed chiato to go. Real quick, here's a little pro tip. You can find hidden coins if you click on certain objects around you. Oh, and about the trees? Hunt as many as you can. Water isn't the only thing that makes them grow. No, no, patience is the key to success. That's all I wanted to say. Don't forget about the mixed chiato. Woo! Click literally everything in the background. Oh, he just gives you presents. I see. How cute. Oh. Visitors. Howler is glad to have visitors. Howler is very lonely. Huh. A beaver. Oh no. Are you here to destroy Powler's beautiful flowers? Don't lie to me. I know a plant killer when I see one. I am going to avenge all the trees you have chopped down before this will be your end game. What? What? Excuse me? <laughs> what? It's kind of... It's kind of cool. I like this. You just gotta get the ground wet. Oh. Eating this loaf of bread. I baked it. Ah, okay, nice. Well, have fun in doing so. Thanks. You too with whatever you're doing. Ja. Thanks. Oh boy. She totally likes me. Welcome to Retrotopia, home of the best selling video games. Choose a level and beat it to get a really neat prize. Okay. Hmm. 
Oh, okay. Yay! Congrats! Here, take take your reward. Got a wooden frog. This level isn't available right now. Please come back later. Oh no. Oh no. Congrats here to take your reward. Ah! Oh. Okay. To stop! You're too close for comfort. Thanks! A green pipe. isn't available right now. What do you mean? Okay, I just done all your other levels though. Oh, hi. Hello there, Mike. He, I've noticed your father's sweet little n lumber company has been going not so well. Well, not to say our family isn't successful. There are loads of customers throwing themselves in left and right for my delicious coffee and treats. Say, I am feeling extra nice today as sales have been oh so high. Let's make a deal for a free coffee to go. If you beat this minigame, I'll hand you over a free coffee to go. Sound good? Give it a try. Sure. Hmm. 
the fuck? Ah, it's a drink! Fuck! Fuck! Doing bad! I would like my coffee to go, please. Thank you very much. Fuck yeah. Thanks. <laughs> I ordered a mixed chiato, not a regular coffee. You really need to listen closely. How could any customer get satisfied with our work? Huh. Well, I've never tried one of these. Let's see how it tastes. Hmm. I would say it was alright. I expected more of you, though. But let's not talk about this incident anymore. You have more important work to do. Son... We actually have a customer. A strange bird who loves rocks. He wants you to build a rock farm. This is important for our reputation. For real, if you fail this, I will ground you forever. I would help, but I'm way too busy complaining over the simple things in life, like weird tasting coffee. Now go. Go and make me a proud beaver. Okay, Dad. Whatever you say. So I don't know what this little area over here is. I was going to build a rock farm. I guess. Oh. Kill them all. Nice. Oh. Okay. I got a few of those now. fuck am I doing with golden acorns? What, what do I do with those? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Nice. Nice. Oh yeah, Seville. An old family friend wants to know you better. He's invited you to his place. The birdhouse. I finally get to figure out what the fuck the birdhouse is? That's exciting. 
It's so nice to finally talk to you, Mike. Your father has always kept you safe in the cabin. I only met you once, back when you were a fetus. Maybe a little older than that. I'm sure you will meet many nice people now that you can f explore freely. Yeah, your father has always had an obsession with safety, thinking the world is dangerous and whatnot. But trust me, funny things happen to him too. Back when I was a young lad traveling the sea. I retired from that years ago. I own a company now called Sea Bill Industries. Trademarked. We build robots and ship them all over the world. You could say that in some way sea traveling is still involved. Here is one tip from me if you want to start your own company. Don't do or make anything people are not asking for. You will only get in trouble. A few years ago, I designed special robots all by myself with the intention of making my closest friends happy. I designed them to reflect their personality and look, but it only got me into trouble. I'm not getting into detail here. Don't want to set up a rant. Just a pro tip from an artist to a future artist. You seem like someone who would take note of that. You seem more attentive than Tyke. I'm glad that I had the chance to meet you today. Hopefully, we can work this out into a good friendship. If you don't mind... <laughs> if you don't mind, I actually have a task for you. You beavers like working, right? My crap pals at the beach need a talented builder to decorate their home. They asked me. But I'm really busy. <clears throat> All the time. This is your opportunity to show me how skilled you are. There may even be a bit of multitasking required. Can you help them? That would be really neat of you. Of course, finish your pie first. No one should ever work when they're hungry. What am I doing? Help the crabs. Hey, bud. Build one of the cocktail bars here. But we simply are missing- <gasps> Oh, no! Oh, poor buddies. I must- I have to help. The crab people have been so kind to me. If it's a bar you want, it's a bar you shall have. You're welcome. Really? Yeah, I guess that's fine. You could have a palm tree. Thank you for your help. Thank you. You know, we could have made it without you. If we still had our robot. Yes, if we had that robot. All right, you weren't there when it happened, but that's weird. That one told you about it. Yes, that's weird. A few years back, the robot industry was booming. Almost everyone got a machine to perform tasks. Seabill actually found the time to create a few robots all by himself. He gave them to some of his closest friends in the friend zone, which we're a part of. We are a part of. Our robot was called Summer Crab. She was designed to find treasure, build houses, and act as a companion. It sometimes felt as if she was alive, not like a robot at all. But we've gotten complaints. Some told us that Summer Crab was seen sneaking out and visiting other inhabitants' places. Even Chipper called us out one day. He thought that Summer Crab was hostile. After Chipper disappeared, people assumed that she was responsible. We had to destroy her. We went with her to the highest cliff, saying that we need some ice for our cocktails. 
we gave her a little push. The moral of the story is that you can make cocktails even without the ice. True. Some people claim to have slighted her during last spring. That's why they started calling her Spring Crab. Anyway, thanks for your help again. We will tell Seabill what great of a job you did. You're welcome. I feel like I should act very soon. Micah's going to ruin the whole thing for me. He will expose me. I can't let that happen. I have to get rid of him. That won't be too much of a problem, though. I've done similar things before. And I will continue to take care of those who find out more than they need to know. I'm a mastermind. I can't fail. I get what I want. Or my name isn't. My name isn't. Uh, did I just have a stroke? I actually forgot my name. But anyway. I'm gonna get you, Mike. I'm always ahead of you. You little brat. Hey, kiddo. Seabill went by. He seemed very happy about you visiting him today. He said that you two already built a good connection, like a nephew and his uncle. And let me tell you, he is a rich uncle. If he ever asks us with something, we should definitely put that before anything. Who knows how much money we will make if we have him as a regular customer. Changing the topic. You will make the brand new Chipomat 2.0 today. How does that sound? Gather all the items you need. If you can't find any, see if you can buy them at the item shop. This is the last thing to do for today. I'm counting on you. Hell yeah. Oh.